Hi, Stark Centeno. And this is my What Causes Cervicogenic Dizziness or Cervical Vertigo series. Now, there are discs in your neck, just like there are discs in your low back. There's one at each level. And we know that the upper cervical disc, the C23 disc or the C34 disc, can cause cervicogenic dizziness or cervical vertigo. The reason why can be that the disc itself can cause pain leading to vertigo because of the way it changes the upper neck motion and the position sensors probably coming in from the suboccipital muscles. But we also know that if you irritate the upper neck nerves because that disc is irritating and exiting spinal nerve, you can also get cervicogenic dizziness or cervical vertigo. So the goal here would be on an MRI and physical exam, trying to figure out if those discs could be causing your cervicogenic dizziness or cervical vertigo. If so, the disc can, can be treated. The disc can be injected with your own platelet-rich plasma to try to treat that disc. You can also inject platelet-rich plasma around those exiting nerves. Now you can use high-dose corticosteroid as is commonly used, but that could be toxic to the local tissues. Uh, hopefully that answers your question about what causes uh, cervical vertigo. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Hey, get this out to more patients by like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks so much.